we actually felt a bit let down by ourselves. The first 20 minutes, we weren't letting ourselves, we let the game go away from us in a way. Like, if we were a bit more clinical in our tackles than that in the first 30 minutes, we would have maybe made the game tighter, it wouldn't have been as easy. And then it's just one of them is, you could say this, that and that. At the end of the day, the better side won. Um, we're taking it on the chin. We're going to walk around, thank all our supporters. Let Guernsey have their moment, because we had our moment in November. It is what, that's sport. But luckily, we've got seven days to refocus and hopefully win the cup back for us. Well, to be honest, we had to make it. It wasn't ideal. We had to make a shift. But, old, you know, lads, lads are still good at adapting. And, uh, you know, when you, when you don't make your first top shots and you leak, you leak yards, uh, they get in behind you. And uh, it, was, it just wasn't to be for us today. And our lads are gutted. It hurts. It hurts a lot. I'm not going to beat around it. We, we were devastated to lose at home in November and we used that as motivation for this time. And, you know, I think the bounce of the ball worked for us a little bit more probably uh, today than, than it did them. And, you know, we, we took our opportunities and, and we got some good tries. But, um, look, I thought both teams played really well. Um, it was just the luck of the draw, I guess, on, on, the, on the other side of it. Those three tries and then the way you started in the second half, the belief must have been there that you were back in the game. Yeah, 100%. The boys did so well to get back into the game. But I think ultimately we made a few good yards in the start of the first half. We conceded then two penalties. And then before you know it, we're playing de down deep inside our 22. And, um, and then that from there, it just clicked for them, rolled for them. And it just wasn't to be for us. We had a distinctive way that we wanted to play. And then if you look at that middle part of the game, it, we kind of went away from that slightly. And um, once we got into that, probably that what is it that last last third we got back into our sets again which was which was fantastic we found the ball into the right spaces that we needed to be and um, we got to score some 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 great tries but um, I think the game was pretty competitive up into that probably 65th minute and then by that stage it just kind of got away from Jersey slightly but look I thought they played really well up into that moment and you know there was a charge down try down here where I think that was probably the change of the game you could see Jersey's um, body language had dropped from there and look we've been in that same situation and the great thing about it is we get to go at it again next week and maybe Jersey are on the other side of that. Look we chatted about it as a group there we said look we felt this feeling on so many occasions uh, it, it, it hurts it, it hurts and uh, you know we'll, we'll let them have this one and just try and regroup and, and, and go again next week but um, but like I said I constantly reminded our boys that how many times we've won the, we've won the trophy and uh, every time you lose it um, you know it makes you uh, even more eager and probably it's probably good for the boys that have felt the feeling because some of them haven't and uh, look like I said, it's going to be difficult next week, really difficult going there with, with a depleted squad. But look, we'll, we'll see what we can do.